very, very shiny, but I'm currently sat in my car outside our next new home. Um, I'm really, really excited. I just got to wait for Sam to arrive and then the estate agent will be here, drop off our keys and then we'll get first look in our apartment since we viewed it. So I'm really, really excited. I'm going to film an empty, an empty flat tour so you can see what it's like inside. Um, this will probably just be a really short video, but I just want to document this. This is such a special moment and yeah. I'm really nervous but I'm also really excited. I felt like I had one of those moments where like you kind of get cold feet on something and you're like oh my god is this the right thing to do? Um, I've never like officially moved out with a guy before so I'm just yeah it's just a big step so hopefully it's all okay. <laughs> I'm out of breath because we've just carried some boxes up but this is our entrance hall. Really high ceiling. Sam's hiding in the kitchen, which is just here. I'll show you that in a minute. And then you walk through into this humongous, oh God, lounge, um, which is super nice. It's got this really lush fireplace and all of them have been filled, so like there's no cold air coming through them. She's left, um, our landlord's like amazing and she's left loads of really lush gold mirrors. And then we've got the massive Victorian windows, which have been replaced with new windows, so it won't be cold in here. Huge ceiling again. I think I'm gonna get curtains that go ceiling to floor. I just think that looks way more grand and that'll look really, really nice in this, <laughs> in this room. Um, she's also left these little hooks because we're not allowed to, that was so pretty, um, hang anything. So you hang this on, Babe, what is that thing around the top? It's like a skirting board, but it's not a skirting board. I don't even know if you can hear me. So you, you hang these onto the fixture rail and then, I've never done this before, so I'm not sure how this is gonna go. Then you tie a little bit of wire and then you hang the frame, like however high you want. So we'll probably have some artwork in here at some point, but that'll be our last thing. So this is a humongous room. This is probably gonna be our dining room and lounge in one. And then you come out here and then on your right, she's got matching lamps all the way through. We have this really cute little modern bathroom. It's quite small, but it's got really cute tiles. Sam actually hates these tiles, so I'm surprised. I'm surprised he said yes to this. I absolutely love them. We've got this little cabinet and then a double shower, which is perfect. And then, the second bedroom's a lot smaller. Um, again, it's got like the lush fireplace, huge, huge ceiling. Um, this is gonna be Sam's gaming room. So he can shut himself in here and game all night long. It's really far away from the bedroom. So I won't be able to hear him because the issue is right now is I can hear him screaming. So we'll come back through. Sammy, which room are you in? The kitchen. Um, this is the spare room, not the spare room. This is the cupboard. Um, there's a light in here, it's got a really horrible carpet, but we've got this massive storage cupboard. Um, shelving, and it's come with all of these bits of storage. Not sure what we're gonna do about this, cause that's horrible, but it's not a priority, so that's fine. Amazing gold massive mirror which I absolutely love and I'm completely obsessed with so I'm really glad that we've got this and then we go into our bedroom um this room's absolutely humongous it's a tiny bit smaller than the lounge it's got this gorgeous I don't know if it's gonna focus because the light's on but a gorgeous lamp and we've actually got a little toggle by our bed so you can turn it off and on um Again, I'm gonna replace the curtains so they hit the floor, but massive. And then the most amazing, amazing, amazing fireplace, which is like marbled and a huge wardrobe. Um, the wardrobe's massive. If I open it up, it's literally humongous. Wait, let me try getting it so you can see how big it is. the other side. I can stand up in the wardrobe and I can't touch the other side and there's like a whole other section up there.
last room as the kitchen. It's a bit of a funny shape, um, but I love it. It's got like gold features, which I absolutely love. And this amazing lino again throughout. Um, I absolutely love that she's gone for navy. I just feel like that really matches the Victorian sort of theme, like dark colors. So the navy and gold, super cute. I love the sink. She also left us some flowers, which is such a nice touch. And then we've got um, storage space up here, um, a dishwasher, a tumble, tumble dryer and a washing machine, storage, fridge freezer, and then other bits and bobs here. And then you can't see because it's winter and it's dark, but this actually looks over to some really beautiful gardens. Um, so yeah, that's really, really nice. end my little house tour here it's probably really short but we're gonna start cleaning to be fair the landlord is our landlord is amazing like this place is near enough immaculate there's some little bits and bobs that we need to do but they've come in filled loads of holes painted over places cleaned the carpets um so we're gonna crack on with that because it's about six o'clock we've just got some snacks from the shop sam's hidden away watching something on his phone in the lounge and um, his parents are probably gonna come around. So I will probably do loads of filming as we're going through this because this is like a really exciting part of our lives. Um, but thank you so much for coming to the channel and I will see you in the next video. I'm hoping to upload maybe once a week, every Sunday. So I'll see you then.